The Musers are the only show in the nation with the courage to stay for the Super Bowl, attend the game, then broadcast live from Radio Row this Monday morning. Brought to you by GMC, the official vehicle of the NFL, Bud Light, Texas versus the Nation.com, and Sports Radio 1310 The Ticket. Oh, she's walking so fast. Killer All right. One more time. We're going to see if we can't string together a little wheelchair go? wireless fun. Where'd she go? Corby and Killer are, no. are at their we're at our best right now because they are traipsing Killer. through the wild. Killer, we're screwed. All right. Go? go back. Go back. Killer. No, Killer. He's trying to put me on an escalator chasing a girl down. <laughs> Who's laughing? Killer, you're going to kill him. And he almost ran over a state trooper trying to flag this girl down. <laughs> All right, that goofy girl from yesterday standing right here if you want her. I don't want anybody from yesterday, Mike. That's a repeat. Yeah, we All need right. fresh meat, Mike. All right, okay. So now we're going back in the media center. Okay. Okay. Let's see what's going on here. You too. Just for Cobain. Yeah. Are we not going to talk to them? Here on the ticket. Okay. Come on, wheels. Right. Do you have Wi-Fi out there? I don't know. <laughs> Why did I just need to ask that question how you over doing? the phone? Hi, how are you? Good. What are you all doing here? Um, we are in town visiting. For the game? No, for the, we're, um, we're from New Orleans, but we live out of town and we're back home just hanging out. That's really weird. Yeah. What's your name? It's a weird life. I'm Lindsay. Lindsay, what do you do? Um, I'm a homemaker slash chef. Okay, that's cool. Does that mean you got kids and stuff? No kids. How oh. old? How old are you? How old am I? <coughs> um, I mean, it doesn't matter. I'm 43. I'll break the ice. I'm. Well, I really do have to think about it. How old am I? Are you serious? You d- okay? They've been drinking. Boy, they have. I don't know. Like, they have. Ask them if they've been drinking. What are you, 28 or something? Right on it, 28. <laughs> <laughs> They're so hammered, Corby. You guys Ask been him. drinking? No, I haven't. Yes, you have. Start? A little later, yeah. Yeah? yeah. What do you have plans? What are you doing? Tonight, uh, we're just kind of hanging out, walking around, seeing what's going on. Okay. Why are you in the media center? Just because, you know. No. I don't like your answers really. right now. Is this your husband right here? Is this guy your husband? Yeah, it's my guy. Oh, that's good. Nice. How long you guys been married? I've been married two years. Two years? Yeah, two years. Sound real you're excited from New Orleans about too. It. Well, you're a big old son of a bitch, aren't you? <laughs> how big are you? How tall are you? Protect me from these. Yeah, you look. You look big. You look. Because you're in a wheelchair. Yeah, you know everything looks big when I'm down here at this level, so it's it's kind of tough. Um, okay, tell so me, tell me you got polio. as as a local New Orleans girl, would you tell me what to do tonight? Like, what's the most fun thing that I can do to avoid all the, the crap? The most fun thing uh, a guy could po- with polio could do. I always stay with Bourbon Street. Um, they have a concert at the Bud Light Hotel. They have a ESPN party at Tag Warmly. If you can get into them. Totally. Playboy party. This chair gets me in anywhere. Where's the Playboy party? It's at Jack's Brewery. That's a play life, huh? Any of those. That's a play life. When are you going to have a kid? That's a good question. I mean, I, I think that your your mom probably asks you the same thing, doesn't she? Yeah, Very she often. Doesn't. She's really good about it. I don't believe you. Mm-hmm. How long have you been married? Two years. Two years? Two years. Okay. Two years. All right. Yeah, probably wait uh, another two another two years or so, and then you'll be ready. I know, right? She's now, are you, are you really into fitness and stuff? You look thin. Yeah, I am. I eat what do you do? What don't I do? Do yoga, kickboxing. Where's this going? Yoga, <laughs> kickboxing, spin. You do it all then, huh? You run marathons? No, I do not. I hate running. Really? I hate running. You have a rabbit? That's why uh, we we differ a little bit. I'm a. Well, it doesn't look like it right now, but. You got polio. You can't run. There, yeah. There was a time when you could run. There was a time that I used to run and run well, but right now it's the knees bothering me a little bit. Um, hey. Okay. Do you like Hitler? <laughs> Do you have a rabbit? I'm sorry. I'm, rabbit. I'm being I'm being fed questions. Rabbit. Oh. Rabbit. From uh, the your, guys that I work with. Is back your here rabbit in named Hitler? This really needs yeah. to be livened up. Rabbit. Do you have a rabbit named Hitler? <laughs> We're getting that fed to us. No. No. Mm-mm. Do you have a I rabbit? do. I am very intrigued about the Holocaust, <laughs> but I do not have a rabbit named Hitler. I am. Every anything about the Holocaust, I I like to learn about. So you like the History Channel and or the Hitler Channel and all that? 
Pretty much, yeah. Does she have a rabbit? And if so, know. what's its <laughs> name? Gone, what's your rabbit's name? <laughs> yeah. Well, what's your rabbit's name then? I don't have a rabbit. <laughs> oh, you don't? I have no animals. Yeah, you do. I no okay, it's you not seem an like animal. very. I have no responsibilities. That's <laughs> you've been <laughs> drinking. <laughs> you need to date our producer while you're married, but you, you guys sound like the same person outside of the exercising and you being cute and all. We're the same, pretty much. Are you really? Yeah. We look like brother and sister, but it's. Oh, you kind of do. But he looks like a thick Kurt Cobain. Oh, God. He's something. I love him. Love him. Yeah, he's dead. <laughs> All right, well, you guys have fun. Enjoy the Super Bowl and uh, take care. Yeah, right on. Right on. Good luck. Stupid bitch. <laughs> Mike sounds so wasted in that. Stupid bitch. That is a... She sounded wasted. Too. She sounded hammered. And you didn't even ask her about it. She wasn't drinking. She told us she was not drinking. Well, then why does she talk therefore, like Eddie Money? Therefore, you don't ask her about drinking when she says she wasn't. You should have pressed the matter. A good reporter presses these matters. Shut up. Seriously. Uh -huh. All right, we're wheeling along now. There definitely is a lot of teardown going on. The Yahoo sports team is taking down stuff. Here, let's talk to, him, talk to her real quick. Hey, um, excuse me, real quick. Hey, I know you're you're working and everything. I'd ask, ask you a question. Who was the best guest you guys had on over here at Yahoo Sports? I wasn't even watching half of it. I was running around. All... Really? <laughs> Literally, I kept going. I mean, we had a lot of names. Who was, who was the best? What do you do? Yeah, exactly. Tracy Morgan was hilarious. Yeah? He was obviously not football, but he was funny. Uh, who else? Oh, the star of the zone's big joke. <laughs> who? <laughs> Gina Carano. Gina Carano. Carano. Gina the, Carano. The boxer? <laughs> Gina Carino, Carano, yeah. You know who her dad is, don't you? He was backup for third string. The Cowboys. Yes, yes, third string for the Cowboys. Hey, David, what number was he? Eighteen. Eighteen. Yeah, he was. Did he ever get in a game? Do you know? Carano got in a game. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I think, I think he did too. I Sally was Ford, excited. Thank you. Take care. Happy Super Bowl. Happy Super Bowl. Yes. Whoever's Great. running the webcam is on triple acid. You want to talk to these two? Okay, we're right behind these two. Watch how I sneak up on them. You're ladies, fine, ladies, you got a second? It's the Colonel. This is my porter. He's the killer. My name is Corby. I'm with the ticket radio station in Dallas, Texas. Love Dallas. What's your name? Jen. Jen, what do you do? I do PR for the Tourism Bureau here, the New Orleans Convention Visitors Bureau. Okay, so you're from here? I am. Huh. Yeah, that's nice. What do you recommend tonight? Um, well... You always need a good place to go eat. Good I agree. Food. I like food. Good music. That's what we do best here in New Orleans is eat, drink, and listen to music. That's true. Now, as part of the convention and tourism bureau and all that stuff, uh, what uh, are, are you required to drink a lot? <laughs> We're not required to drink a lot, but we do get you to choose taste. to. Well, we get to taste some fabulous cocktails because we have a great mixology scene here too. You do have a great mixology scene. We've been talking about the mixology scene. That's crazy. A bar that's right next to the Hotel Modern. You know what I'm talking about? Baluk, yeah. It's, it's great. And the guys that own Baluk also own um, Cure, which is another fabulous mixology bar. Cure. 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 Do they have music that sounds like... No, they just play Friday, I'm in love, over and over again. We have a festival in July called Tales of the Cocktail, and it's all about mixology. So if you have a chance to come back and visit us. Yeah, I doubt I'll come back in July, but maybe Jazz Fest. There you go. We got a great lineup this year. Do you get free tickets to all that stuff? Being part of this? I do not. No. You don't? I do enjoy them as a as a spectator. So. <laughs> do you make over or under, one hundred fifty thousand a year? <laughs> I'm not gonna answer that question. <laughs> come on. How old no. is she? Are you married? No, I'm not married. How old I have is a she? Wonderful boyfriend. Okay, that's cool. How old are you? Twenty seven. And did you go to a college around here too? I did. I went. Well, I went to UC Santa Barbara, and then I um, graduated from LSU. Go Tigers! Oh wow! What drug you out of UC Santa Barbara? Why didn't you finish there? I miss New Orleans. I'm a New Orleans girl. I wanted to come back home. But it God, and Santa Barbara is awesome. It was awesome, but it's good to be back in New Orleans. I love. I love. Did that boyfriend in, have home. anything to do with that? Who has better weed, California or Louisiana? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Come on, the Santa Barbara scene. I don't know. Is your favorite bar called Huge Ass Beers? On um, all right, is, is there the a bar called that? Yes. There's a bar called Huge Ass Beards. Beers. Oh, beers. beers. Yeah, they sell they sell those on Bourbon Street. So yeah. if you wanna have a good drink. A huge ass, a huge ass beer. Did the boyfriend I, I, yes, have anything do. to do with her coming? Did the back? boyfriend have anything to do with you coming back? No. Did you meet him here? Is he a local guy? He's a local guy. Yeah. Okay, that's good. Is he a musician? No. 
We're trying to encourage all women to stay away from musicians. My we think that a musician, so. your grandfather is. Yes. Well, I hope you don't date him. No, I don't what? date him, but I'm saying musicians are wonderful people. How long sometimes, they been sometimes they're dirty. How long have they been dating? Well, <laughs> I don't think so. He's a he's a great a great influence on my life. So. Now, have you been dating this boyfriend long enough to get married? No. <laughs> How long? How long's it been? <laughs> Ten months. This is getting very personal. Well, that's what we do. We like to open up a little died. bit and just kind of. You know, pull some personal stuff out. Ten months is good, though. That's a good long relationship. Congratulations. Does she have implants? So it's nice talking to you. Nice talking you have, to you, too. You have, you have a, a good time. Do you have a rabbit? Ask her. She walked away because oh. she was getting creeped out. You got a rabbit? Good rabbit. What's your rabbit's name? Is it Hitler? <laughs> do you have another one named Rommel? Do you have a rabbit named Hitler? <laughs> <laughs> hey, do you like Hitler? <laughs> what what is that? It's Gordon. What's he doing? He's been I think it was from yesterday morning. He's been weird as hell all week. Like they just send him out and he will ask questions that George and Craig feed him, but he'll just repeat exactly what they say no matter how insane it is. Like you filter out or try to. Uh-huh. But he's been doing this bit where whatever they tell him to ask, he asks it. Oh my god, we're going a hundred miles an hour right now. I do not know what killer is chasing. He is my which where, where are we going? Oh my God! Okay, well, just keep going. Calm down, killer. Let's be cool about this. I'm getting I'm getting sick watching the webcam. How's I'm it going? Throw up. It's going well. How are you? Yeah, I just kind of wheeled up and thought I'd say hi to you. Where are you going? I'm going upstairs, actually. You guys hear about you with the gay cave? You with man? the Gatorade people? I am. So, uh, what did you guys do here exactly? Do you work for Gatorade? I do. I'm sorry. Who are you with? I'm with the Ticket Radio Station in Dallas, America's most listened to radio station. Really? Most listened to? Yes, yes. In the whole U.S.? Uh, I, I, did I stutter? I'm just saying that's quite <laughs> impressive. Well, thank you very much. We're very proud of each other. How's your time been here? What's that? How has your time been here? My you? time has been wonderful. Thank you. Are you from here? Yeah, no, I'm from Chicago. Oh, really? Yeah, We're going to Chicago in like uh, uh, like a couple months for the, uh, to the Cubs and the Rangers. Excellent. I'll call you. Excellent. Ask her if she knows what an electrolyte is. All right, bye-bye. Oh, man. No, I went nowhere. She look. She was walking away from me, wanting no part of it, which most women do. You know, it's well, your job to draw them in, though. Yeah, look. I know. Okay. You see one, or should we just end on a low and take a break? You t looking at the blank chain? Excuse me, madam. <laughs> you got a quick second? Sure. What's your name? Tiffany. Tiffany, who are you with? Oh, really? Oh. What do you do? What's this for? Uh, I'm with the Ticket Radio Station in Dallas, friends with America's Rich favorite Eisen. radio station and most listened to. We're friends with Rich Eisen. Oh. Rich Eisen's our good friend. <laughs> okay, that's cool. <laughs> totally. What do you do? Um, PR. Yeah? It's kind of generic, isn't it? Is it your first job out of college? Uh, yeah, pretty much. Is it really? Where'd you go to college? Georgetown and Florida State. You did the double dip? Did you get a master's or something, or did you just... Got a master's. In, in Florida State? Georgetown. Really? So you're really bright, aren't you? I don't know. <laughs> I think what about eggs? To get, yeah. uh, what about um, eggs? Did you get a master's in eggs? No, I didn't. What was your master's? Uh, spinach. <laughs> spinach? <laughs> <laughs> She's walking away. Okay. She's funny. She ended on a high. That she was did. great. <laughs> What's your master's in? Spinach. <laughs> See, girls can be funny, Mike, for like yeah. one second. No, they can't. That was good. You she laughed. Was funny. Yeah. That's the only time a girl has made me laugh today, or all week, for that matter. All right, honey. All right, community quick hits are on the way. Let's talk about the Greenville St. Patty's Day Parade and an update, I think, on the shooting in Kaufman County yesterday. Broadcasting live from the new Metro PCS mothership at Victory Plaza, hard by the AAC. This is Sports Radio 1310, The Ticket. KTCK Dallas, Fort Worth. KTDK Sanger. KPLX HD2, Fort Worth. A cumulus station. Sports Radio 1310, The Ticket presents Ticket Stock 2013. At the Irving Convention Center, you'll have fun. Yeah! With your P1s. Yeah! At the Irving Convention Center, don't be a loser. Yeah! Is it a boo? Yeah! Before you say goodbye to that sweet part of you, 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 you. February 15th and 16th at the Irving Convention Center in Irving. Come to Ticket Stock. Boom.